Yo, what's up guys? This is Optic Rambo here today with a vlog and uh, I got a few points for you guys today that I want to cover with you guys. So, let's start off. First off, we got the YouTube channel coming uploads. Um, obviously, I'm uploading shit to my own YouTube channel, which is a channel you're on right now. Uh, thank you for subbing up to my personal channel and hopefully it gets bigger fast. As I do want to start getting a lot more content, it's kind of deceive not deceiving but depressing to like upload a video and you only have 200 views on it since I've been uploading the Covenant and getting like four or five thousand uh, but yeah so hopefully I'm gonna build my YouTube channel if you have any friends that like watching Call of Duty competitive videos be sure to send them to my channel I appreciate all the, the extra subs and everything um, there's a one series that I'm gonna be starting fairly soon and it's called uh, amateur breakdown hour uh, mainly what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be taking some of you guys' gameplay and mainly doing what I'm doing in the Think Like Rambo series. And I'm mainly like trying, trying to make you guys understand some of the mistakes you're doing and hopefully everyone can relate to some of the gameplays that are, the people are sending in. And I'm going to take the best ones that I can find. So obviously the more people that send me gameplays, it's going to be the better for the series. Um, you can see my room's a bit, uh, a bit messy right now. I'm currently trying to pack. Um, I'm going to the Gunnerland this weekend. Uh, our team, Optic Gaming and MVS and... I believe up to eight, maybe a bit more. I'm not even sure how many are coming, but YouTubers are actually going to be there at the Envy House this weekend for for a land. So it should be a lot of fun getting hanging out with all the buddies again and uh, my team, and it it should be interesting. Um, as far as MLG land is concerned, a lot of people are following. Uh, well, actually, they just announced it. Uh, Halo is going to be on the circuit this year. They haven't made any strict announcement for Call of Duty if we're going to have anything as far as online play or LAN play or anything in general. Um, I'd like to take this moment and make you guys understand that it's not MLG's fault at this point. It's not up to MLG. It's up to Treyarch, not Treyarch. It's up to Infinity Ward and Activision for them to put out a, obviously the, the possible LAN settings that we need. We need the timer before the game starts so everyone can start the game at the same time and we need every gun to be unlockable on LAN or else they need to rank up accounts, which is not going to be possible for, for a large-scale event. Um, a lot of people can bring out the fact that they can use internet and stuff like that at events because it's been done for for, for nationals, but it's, I mean, it's, if we're going to have large-scale events with 100 teams plus doing that, it's going, to be, it's, it's going to be difficult, and it's not really something that they really should have to deal with. Um, obviously, it is possible. I'm not sure to what extent they want calls in a circuit and what extent they're going to, they're going to make something happen about it. But I do know for sure that they are in contact with those kind of with, with with Infinity Ward, and it's the ball's in their court right now. It's really it's really shitty that that our that our season and future of competitive gaming for this season is actually in the hands of the developers that are actually making the game, and that should be out there to help us out, but really aren't. And it, it kind of sucks. But what what are you gonna do? I mean, life's a bitch sometimes, and you just gotta deal with things. And I really feel like we're, we're not going to die as a community, obviously, with, with Treyarch being really involved. it's We might have a, a slow year, for se, uh, but we'll be back with Hardwood Black Ops 2, obviously, coming out and, uh, at the end of the year. So, And lastly, um, a lot of people are going to be asking me about my stream in the next days, because I'm not going to be streaming until I get uh, my YouTube stream going. Yes, I am switching to YouTube. A lot of you have been probably watching some streams on YouTube and are like, kind of skeptical about it since the the whole YouTube thing right now is pretty bad and I completely agree with you the YouTube streaming is terrible right now but I was giving a time I was given a timeline to make a decision on it and I decided to go on with YouTube um, mostly because of the fact that I'll be able to ha mainly build my own channel and streaming on my own channel and hopefully I have the same si same sort of following audience that I had on Twitch and bring it over to YouTube which pretty much it kind of makes things just simpler for me as far as the whole the, the whole video thing and streaming in general since I can just do everything on my own channel at this point. And uh, there's a few other reasons that I'm really not really going to want to get in depth with, but um, in general, that's really what it is. So I'm going to be streaming on YouTube. Um, as far as YouTube being better, it's going to get better a lot from, from what I know. Hopefully that wasn't just talk. I had a talk with a few members of Machinima and it should get better at some point. Um, I'm not sure how long it's going to take. Uh, some people have been telling me they've been saying a lot of things for the past months now, but it's eventually supposed to get to somewhere what Twitch is right now, so hopefully it is, and hopefully it's a good experience for you guys as well. Um, I really hope that you guys can enjoy some more content from me. Um, obviously, streaming is the thing I enjoy doing the most while I play, since I get to interact with you guys while I'm playing. So, so yeah, that was pretty much it for this vlog, guys. Um, like I said, it, YouTube is pretty much what it is at this point. I'm just trying to go big on YouTube, and hopefully 
put out some good content for you guys and something you guys can all learn from. Instructional videos are, that's pretty much my main thing right now. As far as doing the whole pup scene, uh, obviously I know to a certain extent that's what people on YouTube like watching. Um, I don't necessarily, I'm not going to say I'm not going to do that at some point, but I des definitely don't enjoy doing that as much as some other people might do. I really enjoy rather being out there for you guys and helping you guys learn some ways of the Call of Duty that I that I felt like I would have wanted to know whenever I first started competing. So, um, so yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you guys uh, keep out and uh, enjoy my YouTube stuff. Yeah, peace.